Sejin here. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can convert any 2D image generated by Midjourney or any other image generating platform into a 3D map so you can explore it. Let's dive right in. First, we need to create a depth map of our image generated by Midjourney. Go to convert.leapix.com. I'll be sure to leave all the links in the description. I noticed that images generated by Midjourney at 16:9 ratio works better when you upscale the image. Click on the link that's popping up on top if you want to learn how to upscale your image into higher resolution. First, we need to upload our image to Leapix, so click on the upload button and upload your image. Once it's uploaded, you'll notice that it wiggles a bit to show you depth in your image. Pretty cool, huh? If you click depth map, you'll see the depth field. Black means it's far away and white means it's near. Leapix offers a variety of options to create your depth map, but for the sake of this tutorial, let's do a quick conversion. Now we need to download the depth map, so click on share to process the download. Click depth map, then click save. Here's what the depth field image map looks like. Now let's create our 3D image by going to Instaverse. Here's the URL. Instaverse is currently an experimental 2D to 3D conversion site that lets you explore your 3D generated image. There's a number of features available, at the same time a few are still being prepared. Let's go ahead and upload our depth map that we generated from Leapix by clicking on the 2D to 3D button. First, we need to upload our 2D image, the one we upscaled from Midjourney. Then we need to upload our depth map that we generated from Leapix. And we're done. Now you can do some adjusting of your 3D image by adjusting the size, aspect ratio, and depth of your image along with other options. It's probably best you play around with it and just eyeball it until you feel it's just right. The camera viewing instructions are on the top right. You need to click on the image whenever you want to start zooming into your image. You can also use your pointer to move the image around. If you click and hold on to the W button on your keyboard, you can zoom in through the depth field of your image. If you click and hold on to the S button, you zoom out of the depth field. If you click and hold on to the A or D button, you move side to side of your image map. Using the mouse scroller will zoom in and out of the image as a whole. You can hit the escape button whenever you want to return to the main screen. And there you have it, your own personal way to experiment with your 2D image and convert it to 3D so you can explore it. Pretty interesting, huh? Well, I hope you enjoyed today's tutorial, and if you enjoyed it, please consider giving this video a like, and if you haven't already subscribed to this channel, please subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.